Daniela, how are you going? Hi, Anthony, and uh, good afternoon, Melbourne, and everyone's listening. That's right. Well, um, as you know, yes, it's, a, it's an amazing um, a pageant where they celebrate the diversity and beauty of all, all women. Um, well, basically, the competition encourages women to feel empowered and, you know, to provide charity work and help women to feel more confident. And uh, I'm in a classic division, being over 30. Uh, it's from 30 plus. And um, in preparation, we need to do certain amounts of public appearances, fundraising and volunteering through charity um, to be eligible for, for certain criteria. Um, being one of the classics, yes, it's been an amazing journey so far. Oh my goodness, um, I, was, I was just, oh my god, look. It's basically, I, uh, I saw an appearance of Miss Earth on a uh, morning show, and I asked myself one question, I said, what's stopping me doing that? And it's the, the answer was nothing. So it's like, the rest is history, and I Google uh, pageant, and the first thing that come up is MBA, and it's like, and then after I read, it says, oh, look, no height restriction, no age limit, no weight restriction, it's like, I'm in. <laughs> Oh my God, it's, it's been absolutely incredible. Oh God, I, I felt absolutely amazing. You know, and I've heard this saying that, you know, when you reach your mid-40s, you become invincible. I have never felt so visible <laughs> and just very alive. And I think we should be the role models, you know, because there's a... That's right, because there's a lot of kids out there that are looking up to you. They want to follow, they, you know, you want to lead some examples. I mean, we are all role models. But I think, like I said, I felt like I have this responsibility to be the little mom, you know, the, the moms for the little kids. <laughs> so, I, I yeah. Yes, I uh, have chosen to support uh, Diabetes New South Wales and ACT. And uh, the reason I've chosen uh, Diabetes New South Wales and ACT is because I have been a type 2 diabetic for over 25 years myself. So it's very, very close to home. Um, and I felt like this is now my way of giving something back, you know. Yeah, and, and it's, it's been amazing. It's really um, doing all the charity, the fundraising. It's like I used to walk and think, I've got to be doing something more, you know. And uh, one time I found myself walking around and talking to people, and, and, and it's amazing meeting the uh, mini diamonds and the junior, di you know, uh, diamonds like Ava. She's uh, one of my inspirations. There's a few of them, um, like Ava and Destiny and and um, Kate and yes, Mr. Wayne here. It's like, I have seen the amount of work he has done, the YouTube and the Facebook, and I think he's been an absolute, absolute amazing. And um, yeah, look, I've got my money on you. <laughs> no. And, and yet, and another thing about that, I think now that you mentioned it, I felt very, very amazing when I get this compliment because I, I've, you know, I've tried to help those who want some help, and I'd like to feel uh, I want to be available for them. And perhaps the best compliment I've ever received is that I'm always positive and that I, you know, I'm a role model to them. And I'm like, that's the best compliment I could ever receive. So I, I felt really good about that, and I think. 
you know, being a classic diamond, uh, it's a, you know, it's something great and it comes with responsibility. And being the oldest people in the contest, I think all about diabetes. And, you know, I, I totally enjoy that, the interaction that I uh, have with people. And I, and I felt like, you know, this is, it just feels so right. And uh, I have raised over a thousand dollars for my charity. And uh, thank you so much. Um, and I felt uh, very, very happy about that. Um, and, and the um, Pauline from the Diabetes New South Wales and ACD, she's been assisting me as well and sending me a lot of information. And while I'm online, guys, I've got one of those. They send me like a couple of hundred of those little cards with embedded seeds on them. I'm gonna try not to cry about this, okay? Because this, I, I'm, I'm, I'm live, so I'm gonna. Every single contestant will receive one of these cards from me. This is actually like a tribute to people with diabetes and who have passed away. And what they do is you just soak them in water, put them in the pot with all the um, pot mix, potting mix in them, and they'll actually grow and become a tree. How amazing, how amazing is that? And I'm like, really? <laughs> oh, the surprise is gone, it's out. <laughs> Miss Diamond Australia, and, and you know, I, my confidence, uh, I've gained more confidence, and you know, I can thank MBA for that, the founders of, and the sole um, directors are Charlie and Morgan Mancini, and they have been absolutely tremendous uh, providing support all the way, um, and I, uh, we, we, did, we, we, did, um, what I'm doing now is like just being involved, and you know, me, I love the people I meet along the way. I think generally, I, I believe, uh, it, uh, the 2017 um, class, Miss Classic Diamond, Erin Ostenberg, I think she once said that you know generally the biggest takeaway is the people you meet, the friendship for, and I couldn't agree more. All right, it's been.